For the first time ever, we've been able to design macOS for our own silicon. I'm so excited about what this means for the platform. Our latest release, macOS Big Sur, is absolutely incredible on M1. Big Sur introduces a bold new design, powerful updates for apps like Safari and Messages, and the latest improvements to our industry-leading privacy features. And by designing the whole system together, hardware and software, we're able to make the things you love about your Mac even better. Your Mac now instantly wakes from sleep, just like the iPhone and iPad. Let me show you, but first, let's set the mood. You touch a gun, but don't you know? How cool is that? And with M1, things you do every day, like launching apps, are nearly instantaneous. And Safari, which is already the world's fastest browser, really shines on Apple Silicon. It's now one and a half times speedier at running JavaScript and almost two times more responsive. The whole system is distinctly snappy and system animations are buttery smooth. The sheer speed of M1, together with macOS technologies like Metal, deliver a huge boost to the most demanding apps. So you can render 3D animations or edit raw video footage with ease. Now, part of the secret behind this breakthrough performance is M1's unified memory architecture. We built macOS on Apple Silicon to use the same data formats for things like video decode, GPU, and display. So there's no need for expensive copying or translation. And macOS gives apps access to more graphics memory than ever, unlocking breakthrough performance for tasks ranging from color grading 6K video to playing graphically intensive games or performing real-time machine learning inference. Big Sur also features advanced power management, which intelligently allocates tasks between M1's performance and efficiency cores, automatically optimizing for lightweight tasks like reading a note or performance-intensive tasks like playing a game. So your Mac gives you quiet performance and even better battery life. When it comes to security, M1 represents a major leap forward. For years on iOS, we've worked to continuously advance the state of the art for computer security. And with M1, we're bringing this architecture to the Mac. This includes not only hardware verified secure boot and automatic high performance encryption for all your files, but also new security protections built deep into the code execution architecture of M1, giving you the most advanced security of any personal computer. Mac OS Big Sur is engineered down to its core to fully take advantage of all the capability and power of M1. And it does this all while maintaining everything you love about Mac OS. Of course, we've optimized all of our apps for M1, from every app that comes with Mac OS to every other app made by Apple. Apps like Pages, Numbers, and Keynote, and GarageBand and iMovie are showing us how great performance can be with M1. For example, with Logic Pro, you can run up to three times more instruments and effect plugins. And Final Cut Pro can fly through tasks like rendering a complex timeline up to six times faster. We can't wait for you to unleash your creativity. Now, macOS Big Sur has incredible technologies that enable you to run a greater range of apps than ever before. First are universal apps. Simply put, universal apps are the fastest, most powerful apps you can get. Universal apps include a native binary version built for Apple Silicon, as well as a native version for Intel processors. The two come together into a single app that you can download from the App Store or from the web, meaning that one app can run on all of your Macs. We're hearing a lot of excitement from developers as they get ready to launch their universal apps. For example, Omni Group is bringing universal versions of all of their great Mac apps. And Adobe is bringing universal versions of their apps, starting with Lightroom next month, and other flagship apps, including Photoshop, early next year. For existing apps that haven't yet upgraded to Universal, Big Sur includes an amazing new technology, Rosetta 2. On M1 systems, Rosetta seamlessly runs apps built for Intel-based Macs. So even without an app update, you can keep working on that Fusion 360 project and get to the next level in your favorite game. Thanks to Metal and M1, some of the most graphically demanding apps actually perform better under Rosetta than they did running natively on previous Macs with integrated graphics. It's really incredible. The transition to M1 is also great for developers. M1 scales up the architecture that they're already accustomed to on iPhone and iPad, 
so they can optimize their code across the whole family. And these new Macs can do something that no Mac has ever done before. For the first time ever, you can run your favorite iPhone and iPad apps directly on your Mac. You'll have more games to play, more content to watch, and more apps for everything you want to do. All together, you get access to the biggest collection of apps ever for the Mac. And it's only going to get better as developers continue to build new apps for M1. Here are some of them in action. Hey. Hi. Oh, hey, there you are. Hello, world. Hello, world. I work for a company called Panic. Cinema 4D. Old as Gate 3. I've been at Adobe for over 20 years. At Panic, we make Mac software. A coding app for kids. Mm-hmm. Helps people be less boring on video. When we first heard about Apple Silicon on Mac, we're announcing that the Mac is transitioning to our own Apple Silicon. <laughs> it uh, blew my mind. One word was amazing. amazing. We were just waiting for this specific moment. <laughs> what does this mean for the desktop? A device that we all think we know so well. We got the first developer units uh, as soon as they were announced. This was the easiest transition that we've ever had. Getting our apps ready for Apple Silicon on Mac literally took us a day. We didn't really have to do anything to port to them. Hit the run button. Took me 10 minutes. Here we are. We got this, we got this, we got this. Boom. Wow you immediately notice that it's incredibly fast. We can move much faster. There are some operations which are really quite remarkable. The select object, we've seen that operation up to eight times faster. We can travel the entire world of the Forgotten Realms without any kind of texture popping. It was rendering two times faster. Three times faster. Four times. Eight times. Ten times. Ten times. Much, much faster. Super schneller. Mega schnell. People are going to be blown away. There's some dark magic at work. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It just feels super smooth. Super smooth. You don't have to use any of that. <laughs> For us, it's always about the power. The more powerful the computer is, the more we can have fun in our apps. For example, using uh, Coromel to automatically detect hand position. And then 8K draw footage. Hundreds of thousands of layers. Millions of objects. Almost limitless interactivity. Rotate, zoom. We can keep zooming in, keep zooming in some more. At this point, we're 100 million percent zoomed in. The future that I dream of, let me look into the crystal ball. A seamless workflow from your phone or your iPad to your Mac. Pushing the limits on each and every surface. You open that giant file and boom, it's there. See the infiniteness in what you can create. It's just a different level of what we thought was ever going to be possible. We are in the future right now. This is going to be huge. What can't we do with Apple Silicon on Mac? Um. Super good question. It's amazing to see developers take advantage of the incredible performance 